Before we get into today's video, be sure to grab PIA or Express. They are great to stopping ISP throttling, website blocking, while keeping your privacy safe when you're browsing. They also allow you to do torrents, media streaming, wares, so on and so forth. They also support different devices and payment methods. Links below. What's going on you guys welcome back to another let's talk so the first thing being is this whole rampage thing if you guys don't know rampage is a security exploit that uses the row hammer it's basically an effect a defect and hardware issue with the ram of android devices this has been a problem since 2012 so 2012 and device devices made in that year and higher are affected ddr 2 3 4 and obviously up are majorly affected with this so to sum it up basically a malicious application will attack the RAM until it gets access and when it gets access whoever has made this application has full access to your phone they can get passwords they can get everything they have full access this does affect Android devices as they have the exact same thing these most of these are mobile chips so on and so forth this is a huge, huge thing. Now, there's a couple patches. However, do people really need to panic? No. The reason being is most people get stuff from the Play Store. So, you know, obviously, if the Play Store has got word of a rogue application, they end up removing it pretty quickly. Like, they don't play, they don't play games, right? So, if you're somebody who has the unknown sources ticked and you're sideloading APKs, you really need to watch. You are the guys who are gonna be affected by this if you happen to get hit. Now, the only way to get around this would be for you to basically format your device, okay? Now, should you worry? Again, no. If you're somebody who does the side loading of APKs, you really need to watch who you're trusting. That goes for sites, forms, YouTubers, because YouTubers can even grab APKs from unknown sources put them on that file pin shit and you could end up loading it there is one form that is trusted and it's mobilism i think it's called i did a video called top apk websites the first website is that one it's a form you can grab any apk there legit ad free modded whatever it may be the people who actually do it are trusted okay so again if you, if you know of 50 or 100 different APK sites and you're somebody who's downloaded an APK that has an ad and links to another site to grab that official APK or whatever, stay the hell away from those. Um, it, from what I understand, nobody has actually really made anything to run off this. But even, you know, somebody that you may trust could end up doing this. You know, sport APKs, IPTV APKs could end up implementing something to do this, okay? So this is a really crucial time, and I seriously mean this, a really crucial time to watch what you are loading. And if you guys don't know, there is security programs and apps that you can load on your phone and on your Android, Android device. AVG, Avir, Avira, I think it's called, Avast, Norton's, uh, Bitdefender, Kaspersky, ESET, um, 360 Security, Trend Micro, there was a whole crap load. Dr. Webb, there was even free and paid alternatives. Again, it's up to you if you want to find a modded one. Most of these will scan and find malware and stuff to do with your device because there also is malware stuff that can wreak havoc on your device. So it's always good to stay protected and have that sense of security and you know not run the risk of having somebody have full control of your goddamn device now the second thing i want to talk about is not really going to affect anybody however depending on what you daily search it will google as we all know has been removing pirated links i don't know for how long and there was an article by torrent freak and other websites that google purged 65 thousand different sites okay so if you're somebody who goes on google and types and you know how to get said movie tv show or wares or whatever you may not find the sites you may not find many search results because google is removing these because of pressure from the mpaa riaa 
software companies, so on and so forth. And obviously Google, Google, Bing, and Yahoo, and other search engines do the exact same thing. They comply to these, they remove them. This is, I say this is bad because in terms of new users looking for stuff to do with Cody add-ons, this could have end up affecting that. They could end up removing websites and searches to videos and all that from the Google search. So basically new users won't be able to find what they're looking for to do with Cody add-ons, finding movies, finding wares, and you know, music, okay? So the only alternative so far from what I know, they don't actually remove stuff. And if you guys do or do not know, Google, Yahoo, Bing, they like to track stuff. There's a browser that doesn't, or a search engine, I should say, that doesn't, which is DuckDuckGo. You can go on DuckDuckGo with certain keywords. You can find wares and stuff like that and movies and, you know, music and so on and so forth. And not have to worry about stuff being tracked also. It is a good search engine. It's something that you should either think to switching to or to using if you're looking for that content. If you just Google, you know, websites and search terms and stuff like that, you should be good. But if you're somebody who does that kind of stuff, you really need to watch. So, and <coughs> if you guys don't know, this can affect sites massively because if they're moved, these sites don't get new visitors, they don't get visitors, they don't get the AdSense, and they can end up closing down, or they end up losing the revenue to keep the servers and stuff like that running, which, again, is detrimental to a site that relies on search engines to pull traffic to it. So in the coming years, I see this being a massive issue, and I can see Cody stuff disappearing off the search. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, see you in my next one. I made it to the end of the video. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Don't forget, on the left is a video in Main Lake, and on the right, you can check out my last video again. Thank you for checking out the video. It means a lot. See you on my next one. Peace.